Yeah, you YouTube, this is uh, Legend445 and I am doing the uh, campaign mode of oh, Gears of War 3. Now, I apologise that it's not the beginning of the campaign that you've missed about. I've already played about an hour. I did record the footage, but it got corrupt, so I had to delete it, and that's why I'm starting this. I thought, okay, let's just continue on, get the campaign finished, and then if you really want to see it, I'll go back and do it. It's not, it's not real much that you're missing. You're mainly missing a storyline. There's no action. There is a bit of action, but so start off with you basically right at the very beginning of the campaign you start off as Marcus and Marcus Phoenix yeah, that's his name. and then you start off in his dream now his dream is I think of a previous like Gears of War 1 or Gears of War 2 or something like that of him trying to save his dad but the building ends up falling on top of him so Marcus has thought that his dad has been dead all these years until one of their former captains or general comes back after deserting him and taking half the stuff. So he comes back and he's like, he's, he's trying to get in charge again, kind of thing. I wouldn't say in charge, but he's, he's trying to, he still thinks he's got his same role, which he hasn't. They hate him big time. <clears throat> but he also gives Marcus a disc which has got uh, a recording from his dad so he doesn't know, he looks his dad, he thinks it's real because his dad looks old he's aged and stuff like that so he thinks it's real but he doesn't know whether it's true or not so that's you start off by that's your main objective to go and find his dad and and find out if he's still alive or if he's dead or not but so you start off you go around shooting a few things it's basically you see later in my later vids videos that I'm gonna put up it's the same as this one, but you're playing as Marcus on the actual ship, rather than playing as Cole trying to look for supplies and stuff like that. So they, they, it's good the way they've done both sides of their stories. Well, both sides of what was happening, so you get a full thingy. Um, what I like about the game, the main thing is just the gore, the amount of enemies you can just run and gun them. I know <laughs> you see, I think it's in this vid or one of my other videos that I'll put up later. I do die a few times and you could see with that big ass kind of monster thing that I was just getting killed and killed and killed. It was just basically throwing its kind of like axe arm at me and just kept hitting me. It hits you through cover and all so you can't they're not easy to take down, they are not, I don't like taking them down, but... So that's the main thing, and I think they've improved... They've improved the graphics and the actual, like, video... <coughs> sorry. The video and stuff like that. Uh, but it is a, is a very good game. Online is very balanced, you don't get... Pe you, get you do get good people who can actually play it, but it's not unfair. If you know what I mean. If they if they work together as a team, then obviously they can get more kills than going solo. But then sometimes splitting up is better than staying all together. So it it meets everyone's kind of needs or play play styles. Let's call it. It meets everyone's play styles. As you, um, I've already got a multiplayer video up on YouTube. I'll put a link in it, and you can see how I play. I'm quite a, a lone wolf, but I will, I will. As as in the video, you can see that my friends get in shot, 
from somewhere. I will jump out of cover and give him covering fire so he can get away. But so I am a very I am a team player, but I'm also a lone wolf. I prefer to go running running straight in with my shotgun, try and blow the crap out of the people, and then just <laughs> either get blown crap out of me or so yeah. <laughs> Um, <clears throat> so at this moment in time Cole is as I said looking for supplies we've gone I don't know if we've gone through the warehouse yet we've gone through a shopping market I think this is the warehouse just at this moment in time and then we go off to the stadium now Cole in this town can't remember where it was is a, a fam famous footballer and he's got little cardboard cutouts, and you do you do have like a little bit of fun where you you basically got to pick up a bomb, run, and then plant it, and it's like playing a game of, well, we call it Amer well American football, since I'm English. <laughs> um, so that's that's what's in this vid. There is some some quite good cutscenes. I do I do watch all the cutscenes. I don't know if you can sk skip them anyway, but. Uh, I enjoy the storyline of it. It's it's it keeps you interesting yet not over long that it's boring as hell. So that that's another good thing about it. Also, the amount of weapons that you can get, they've increased it. They've I think they've that you've got like the old weapons. You've also got the new retro lancer. Uh, I think there's a uh, you've got a thing called a cleaver. What you see in my later videos, I think there's a, f a few more new weapons. I'm not, I, I can't, can't remember. Off the, you've got the one shot special weapon. What's quite good fun actually, if, especially if you can hit them. You just see your heads blow off and stuff. <laughs> yeah. But um, this bit, this bit coming up, I do die quite a few times. But hey, -ho, you'll see me. Die. Enjoys. What's coming up next? I will be. I've recorded about five, ten minute slots of this, so this is the first one. So I'll bring, I'll bring the second, third, fourth, and fifth ASAP. I try and put commentary over them just so you know, but it won't be as long as this one. Obviously, I've got to shorten this down. Um, uh, that's coming up. I've got some more multiplayer gameplay coming up. I've got some Minecraft. If you can please go and watch my Minecraft video, it might be half an hour, but basically let it load, skip to about halfway or some sort, and then just give me improvements, give me something what I can make. Just leave comments. It does help. Every, every single view helps. It gets it out there. It gets me as a channel uh, to grow, etc. Um, but yeah, so you you should expect more, a lot more Gears of War videos, because I love Gears of War. I've been a fan ever since, and this is how I die. <laughs> I'm just getting melted. <laughs> uh, so, thank you. Oh, please comment, rate, and subscribe. And thank you for listening, and I shall see you later. Bye.